The headline is this, NRA declared terrorist organization. Uh, it's on Fox, it's on Newsweek, a bunch of different... Welcome back to the Hank Strange Situation, Lifestyles of the Locked and Loaded. All right, are you ready for this one? I'm gonna call this one in defense of the NRA. What? Yeah, I'm clickbaiting you a little bit. Check out the video. All right, so, um, this is so funny, it's not even funny. All right, if you check the news, there's a whole bunch of different articles running right now, and basically the headline is this, NRA declared terrorist organization. Uh, it's on Fox. It's on Newsweek, a bunch of different places. Um, I'll, I'll go, let's go to the Newsweek article. I'll go there, I'll check that one out. San Francisco Board of Supervisors declares NRA a domestic terrorist organization, urges other cities, states, and the federal government to do the same. <laughs> okay, San Francisco's legislative body has challenged other American cities and states to follow its lead and formally condemn the National Rifle Association, NRA. The Californian City's Board of Supervisors passed a resolution on Tuesday officially labeling the gun rights group a domestic terrorist organization. District 2 Supervisor Catherine Stefani, whose district includes the Marina and Presidio, wrote the declaration stating that the NRA spreads propaganda that misinforms and aims to deceive the public about the dangers of gun violence. It said the NRA musters its considerable wealth and organizational strength to promote gun ownership and incite gun owners to acts of violence. All countries have violent and hateful people, but only in America do we give them ready access to assault weapons and large capacity magazines, thanks in large part to the National Rifle Association's influence. The declaration read, okay, we can go on and on with this crap. It's a stunt, definitely a stunt. Um, San Francisco, have you heard of Antifa? Definitely a terrorist organization. NRA, and like I said in the beginning of this, this is in defense of the NRA. I'm no fan right now. I have been in the past, have supported them, given them my money. Of course, I believe in the Second Amendment. I'm an American. Patriot. You know, you don't have anything you can't defend. I believe in that. But lately, I've been really mad at the NRA. Lots of mismanagement, corruption, lots of bad things, I think, going on over there. Lots of distraction from the point right now. And that's why we're so wide open, because the leaders at the NRA are focused more on themselves than what the true mission should be, for sure. But they're not a terrorist organization. They've never done anything to hurt anyone. They just haven't done it. What they've done is supported the Second Amendment in America. They've done a bad job lately, for sure. Terrorist organization, you have lost your mind. Totally insane. That's completely, entirely insane. And at the same time, you've got Antifa running around. At the same time, the people on the left are out there threatening people and actually showing up at people's houses, um, getting online and social media and getting away with threatening people, inciting violence on people. And then the folks like myself, on this side of the argument, we're the bad guys. It's a little ridiculous, but it's indicative of the crazy, ridiculous world that we're living in right now. Um, I'm not going to make this a long video. It's not even worth it. It's kind of stupid, but hey, it's out there. And uh, I'm pretty sure the media is going to pick this up and run with it. But here's what I have to say. NRA, a lot of things. Definitely not doing so good. Definitely not in all of our good books right now. But nowhere near a terrorist organization. Just might want to think about that. Get your priorities straight. The NRA is working hard for the people in your city as well so that they're able to defend themselves not only in your city but when they go anywhere in America. This is what the Second Amendment is about. Maybe you guys don't understand that. So maybe back in the day the King of England would have labeled the American patriots as terrorists for sure. I believe that. And what you're doing is that same thing. Obviously you intend on enslaving the people of the city of San Francisco. I believe that. That's what you guys are doing, right? You're not helping them. You're making things more difficult for the people in your city. 
you're making it harder for them to to rely on themselves to defend themselves you're taxing the living crap out of them putting them in a police state you're allowing actual terrorist organizations like Antifa to thrive within your city there's so many homeless people good hard working people people that have multiple jobs are homeless in your city because of what you guys have done and now what you're doing is deflecting and calling other people terrorists shame on you I think people see through your bullshit I definitely do alright like I said I'm not gonna go on and on here I just wanted to throw this out respond to this ridiculousness that's hitting the airwaves you guys can tell me what you think about it I, I think I have some idea of that but you know we got some people in here who hate freedom who believe in this kind of crap everyone's free to uh, drop their comment here you know we'll check it out we'll hear what you have to say um, don't forget to subscribe here to the channel thumbs up also ring the bell so you can be notified when we go live and of course you know what we have a link in the description somewhere down there where you can join up with GOA gun owners of America for like 15 bucks help support the cause fight for the second amendment I appreciate you doing it. I'm out of here. Peace.